Hello viewers, I'm here with Mary Jubbly and um, uh, she's taught me so many recipes that I finally thought I'm going to bring her into my culinary world, which is not only Italian, but Turkish. My grandmother is from Istanbul. She makes a dish called bulemas and it's a spinach pastry. Um, I'm going to teach Mary how to do it. She's already tasted them. She loved them. So we're going to move forward and teach her how to make, make them. Um, so we're going to start. Oh, now mind you, the lemmas are made with either phyllo or a dough that my grandmother would stretch out to be almost paper thin. I am doing the easy way which is uh, a pastry skins and they come out just as good. Okay. Try to keep them moist. If they dry out, no good. No good. This is an egg wash. It's the glue. Handful. A little bit of salt. You don't have to put salt if people are salt because this cheese is a salty cheese. And what cheese is that you're using? This is a, a Pecorino Romano. The brand I use is Logatelli, but any Pecorino Romano would work. But like I said, any of them, they're salty. So I just happen to love salt. Me too. And roll it, give it a twist. Stick a toothpick. Put the side that you rolled toward the pan so it doesn't open. We eat this with boiled eggs. We got hard boiled eggs are cooking at Marion's and watermelon. Paulie's coming with the watermelon and olives. Oh my goodness. And Any? a cup of coffee. <laughs> And a cup of coffee. Is it a morning thing? We do eat it in the morning, oh, you know. Wow. That's good to know. Split. It's okay. Son of a gun. My mom was Sephardic. Sephardic. My mom spoke oh. Spanish. We don't oh. we don't know Spanish, but she did, and so did my grandmother speak Spanish. Very, very broken English. Okay, so now we're gonna do an egg wash on the bulema. With my egg wash, I uh, beat the egg and I put a little bit of milk. You don't have to, you probably could even use water with the egg. But this is, this is how my mama did it. Mm -hmm. What an honor yeah. that I could be showing Mary Jubbly how to cook something, because <laughs> she is such an excellent cook. So are you. Excellent. So are you, it's I don't know. different gifts for different things. And then we sprinkle a little bit of that Logatelli mm. on the top. Interesting. And now we'll be putting it into the oven at 350 until it's golden brown. I start out on the first rock, rack on the bottom of my oven. Halfway through, then I move it to the top. 
and then I look, just keep an eye on it, lift it, make sure the bottom is cooked and the top is golden brown. And there you have it. Have a cup of coffee, a hard boiled egg, some olives, black olives here, and uh, bon appetit. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be back. We take the I'm now going Damn. to okay. move this Whoa. tray on. Uh, quiet down in the background there. I'm going to move this to the top and put my new one onto the bottom. So I think this probably has about another. Oh, um, 20 minutes. Um, I think they're ready. We're going to pull them out now. Oh. Okay. This is what they should look like. Screws up the mind of, of an 18-year-old, especially when you're only 18 years old. It's hard to see two people dead for two, three days and serve them. And, and they feel a little guilty. They feel a little guilty, but it's good.